Hi, Allie Cook here for Dentistry Today. Welcome once again to the CDA Presents in Anaheim, California. Right now we're at the XDR Radiology booth and I am happy to introduce Miss Sandra Gonzalez, RDA. Sandra, thanks for joining us. Thanks. Thank you very much. Now, tell me right off the bat, why are real clinicians important to XDR? Well, real clinicians are important to XDR because they have real world experience. So, you know, we think that's very important to be able to relate to uh, a dental staff. You know, we know what they're going through. We know that they have rooms to clean, patients waiting, doctors waiting, you know, and they, they have to take x-rays efficiently. And um, so, you know, we, we uh, have that real world experience and our clinical department, We've worked in all types of environments. We've worked in corporate offices, private offices, mobile offices, correction facilities, so we, we cover it all. Uh, we have dental assistants and uh, hygienists. And, um, and so, yeah, it just helps us relate to the customer. It also helps communication to the technical department. Um, you know, when, that, when we do that kind of stuff, when we relate to the techs what is happening in an operatory, then that kind of stuff will result in a future development you know, for, for our software and our sensor. Um, recently, it resulted in our patented uh, sensor that has very minimal mesial dead space because we told the techs that it takes, you know, it's, it's difficult sometimes to capture that distal of the canine, you know? And the techs sometimes, you know, they don't really know what's going on in an operatory, so since we tell them all those things and we relate this information to to uh, the developers and the programmers, then they're able to help develop the software and and cater it and de uh, cater it to a dental operatory, dental office. That's great. So, so you have yeah. communication flowing amongst all members of the team. Yes. Yeah. And so yeah. So so real clinicians are very important to us. Yeah. And one of the things you offer that I want to talk to you about is on-site training. Uh, tell us about what you do, what happens in the training, and why that's important. Yeah. Uh, well, you know, if uh, we always recommend on-site training for people who have either never used digital experience, I mean, they don't have any digital experience, I'm sorry, or if they've only used sensors that are a little thicker than ours. Um, there's a little bit of a learning curve, you know, so, you know, when someone's new to digital, we like to go out and show them everything about the digital system and how to use it in a clinical environment. We show them all the tips and tricks and how to make it easier on the staff, how to make it easier on the patient. Um, you know, and it's just, and we go through, when we're there in the office, you know, we, we check all the computers, we talk about exposure, which is stay, you know, staying within the Alara principle, it's very important. And when you're using digital, it's, you have to think a little bit more about what you're doing, you know, so that's the kind of stuff we show them and talk to them about to make it as easy as possible for them. Because, you know, when you're using film and things like that, when you're coming from that kind of stuff, we, we tend to just kind of go through the motions sometimes. Right. And now with digital, you have to kind of think a little bit more about it. And so on-site training makes that transition into digital a lot easier. And it sounds like it's a very comprehensive program, too. I mean, it sounds like you're covering everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we cover all of it, you know, even on how to talk to the patients. You know, because sometimes it can be a lot of psychological. You know, you're trying to put this <laughs> thing in their mouth and take an x-ray, and they, you know, and certain words that you say can help or hinder you, you know. so. We kind of yeah. I, so we I, let them. I would never have thought of that. That's an interesting aspect that you offer. Oh yeah, and it's and it it helps. You know, when they when we get to talk to the staff and let them know our experience and and what we've kind of the kind of patients we've come across and mm -hmm. like people with tori and pedo and elderly and all that kind of stuff. So we go through all that with the staff and and it seems to be received very well. You know, we uh, we give a little quiz at the end. You know, to make sure that everyone. You know, paid attention, paid attention <laughs> and understood, and that usually that usually makes the doctor, you know, relieved that yeah, so proof they, that the staff like learned they can something. Be confident that their yeah. their staff went through the training. Yeah. Well, that's all wonderful, and um, definitely come down to the XDR booth if you're here at CDA. Learn more about it, come and and if you can't come to CDA, uh, where can people find out more? Yeah, you can just go to the website xdrradiology.com, uh, or just give us a call, and you know, you can speak to any of our customer service, technical department sales department, clinical, all of us. So uh, the number to reach us, 888-XDR-X-RAY. It's an easy number. All right, well, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. And thanks for watching.